and welcome to today's video. I was lucky enough to get to fox hunt on one of the Master of the Foxhounds horses the other day. The hunt was also on her property. In this video, I will show you what I pack when I'm not bringing my own horse somewhere, and will also show you a chat in the car, some pictures and videos from the hunt, and I'll talk through those too. So, enjoy the video! Alright, so welcome to my tech room. I promise you will get a barn tour. It's in the works. It just takes a lot more to get ready for that one than some of the others. But I wanted to quickly just go over what I'm bringing. So, obviously, helmet is coming. This is the Trauma Void EQ3 helmet. Um, I'm also bringing some really nice winter riding gloves. I'm bringing a hairnet, and also I have a normal hair tie because I normally use scrunchies just because they work best with my hair, um, but you can't do that with a hairnet, it would look weird. Um, and then um, the other thing I'm bringing is my saddle. Um, I love my saddle dearly. Absolutely wonderful. Here it is. It's a tad coffin, which is just amazing. I love it so much. So, bringing my saddle. We also have a white fitted saddle pad I need to bring in from inside. Hi, the puppy's down here. Basie, say hi. Um, but yeah, saddle, helmet, gloves. We have some hand warmers and so that'll definitely be needed i think that's probably about everything we're bringing so it's a lot easier when you're not bringing a horse makes it a lot easier to get ready in the morning so i'll probably see you in the car all right so we are in the car um heading to fox hide there's my mom driving <laughs> um so I basically like what's gonna happen when I get there I'm riding one of the hunts horses and he actually lives on the master of the foxhounds property which is where we're hunting so we're basically just hunting in his backyard which is really fun um, so I've ridden this horse I've hunted him twice before and he's so much fun and we're just like and we're so lucky that we get to ride him um, and be given the opportunity to ride just because it has been gross weather here recently so I've barely gotten to ride Oliver um I've only hunted Oliver once and he does he's super good but he does get excited which makes sense he's never really done that before so um I didn't think it'd be smart to bring him to hunt because we really haven't ridden much the last couple weeks so I didn't feel prepared so we're really lucky to be able to do this so when I get there, I am going to see my horse, get him ready, and I have to make sure I remember to say hi to all the staff. So the master of the foxhounds, the huntsmen, the whippers in, everyone like that. Um, you want to say good morning to and thank you and goodbye before you leave, which is something I learned today. So to make sure I do that and trying to think what else. Basically, you just kind of get on and or wait <laughs> until you have further instruction for what you're going to do. So and you have to get your horse ready. Yeah, I said that, I think. But yeah, obviously get my horse ready, get him tacked up, all of that. And I have a couple friends who are hunting with me, so that'll be really fun. It's always fun when you have friends. All right, so here is Jameson. As you can see, he's very cute, very big. There I am on him. And so we headed up to the place where we were all going to head out to the hunt. And there I am with my friends. So we had to go up a big driveway up to this place where we started. And yeah. Everyone's happy, ready to get going. Here's a little video where we're going and heading out. The woman in the red jacket is the huntsman. Or sorry, no, the master of the foxhounds. Um, and 
she basically tells me here, I'm going to be right behind her. That's where the horse likes to go in first flight. And then my two friends were behind me and a couple other people were also in first flight. So basically our job as first flight is to stay near our huntsmen and the hounds and kind of were right with the action the whole time, which is a lot of fun. It means a lot of trotting and cantering and some galloping. So yeah, here there were barely any sightings of us from the people on the ground um, or in the cars like our parents, but these pictures were taken as we were crossing this little gravel thing. There I am, <laughs> trying to stay off his back. It was a really big, steep hill. Um, and my friend's on a greener pony. She's been absolutely incredible so far. Um, but I <laughs> always get worried and start checking in on her and looking back to make sure she does the new things well, which of course she did. Um, so I need to <laughs> stop doing that as much, but I thought that was really funny. Um, and then you can see once we get on the road, we start trotting to catch up with our huntsmen. I don't know why my mom flipped the camera there, but there we are trotting along, trotting along the road, catching up. Um, and yeah, so <laughs> Jameson actually has a really bouncy trot that's pretty hard to ride, so sorry if I look like I'm sloshing around up there. I try my hardest, but we were riding 10 miles, I think. It was so after we had been riding for close to three hours, the master of the fox hunts told my friends and I that we could head back to the barn because it was so cold and she knew that Jameson knows the trails and the way home. And a couple times we thought that we knew better than him and that's why we got a little bit lost but eventually I went in front and let Jameson lead us home on the buckle and so I have some clips from that here. But we're lost. Um, we don't trust my sense of direction we're anymore. Trust, we're trusting the horse. We uh yeah. We're no nope. the horse, not no. Smile. We're not lost anymore. Wait. What? What's our final mile count? Okay. 10.8. 10.8 miles. <laughs> See if you can get Fidget to go back with you. Oh, are they back? No, but Fidget's back. Oh, okay. Jameson looks very tired. <laughs> Your honey's like, I'm ready. Yeah, honey's the We're just getting started. Are you? Is I got it. All right, so you saw those videos where we <laughs> kind of got lost, but we eventually found our way home, so that's good. But yeah, the hunt was super fun. We had some moments of like fully galloping up really steep hills and all this stuff. I'm very happy I didn't bring Oliver. That would not have been fun. But riding Jameson was amazing. He is such a fun horse to ride. He's so confident and knows his job so well. So thank you for watching and keep your eyes peeled for new videos coming soon. Bye!